it's AJ Van Rixtel and it's time for the Time Lapse Tuesday video. In today's video, what I'm doing is a mashup of Pokemon meets Alice in Wonderland. Or is that the other way around? Anyway, so I started off by doing some rough sketches, just getting some various shapes around. And then I began to add a bit more detail to some of the characters and getting more refined with those with just with the pencil Once I was happy with the refinement of the pencil lines, I then scanned this image into the computer, then printed it off a bit smaller on an A4 sheet and then started to go over the lines that I had with a fine liner pen. This was so that I could get on to do the colour with some markers for this. I wanted to do this as a bit of a comic-y sort of feel to it so I did add it as a background and as I was going on I was going to make this a little bigger uh, but I realised that um, some of the Pokemon that I drew weren't that great so I cut it and cut them out a bit uh, so it came a bit smaller than A4 in the end. I used Spectrum Noir markers to colour this in. I really enjoy using these markers, I find that they're quite easily blendable and you can get a good variety of colours. I did do a little bit of a swash um, every time I used the colour just to make sure uh, I was getting the right colour for, for the individual Pokemon. I decided to use markers in order to do this because I felt as though it would be a really nice effect. All that and I'd be able to get some decent effects with these. I'm particularly happy with the way the Ghastly and the Haunter turned out uh, on this. Uh, I feel as though I managed to really capture their colours quite well. I did do a bit of practice beforehand trying to get the right sort of colour for the like purpley lilac colour of Ghastly. And I also really like the way I managed to get the Sunflora to turn out uh, in, the, in the bottom corner. Once I had done all of the colour work, I then went back with the uh, with a thicker marker, a thicker pen, to go over the outlines again, just to add a bit more of a pop to it. And once that was done, it, this picture was pretty much completed. I'm really happy with the way this turned out, and I would love to do something more like this. The concept of Alice in Wonderland meets Pokemon has been something that I've been thinking of for a while now and I just thought it'd be really interesting to see some of the Pokemon as the take the form of the characters from Alice in Wonderland. So for example you've got Meowth as the Cheshire Cat, uh, the flower, the grass Pokemon below sort of as the 
plants and things as the pansies and stuff that you saw who chased Alice through Wonderland because they thought she was a weed. And I just really, really enjoyed this particular uh, piece and it is something that I've always wanted to do and I hope you enjoyed watching me do it too. So until next time, ta Thank you for watching and I really do hope you enjoyed uh, this little video. Uh, let me know in the comments below what you want to see me do. It's greatly appreciated for any comments. Also, if you could like and subscribe, that, that would be really appreciated. And check out some of my playlists to the right. Ta-ra!